Hello, I'm the Party Blarder. Today we're going to be checking out some horror games. We're going to play three to be exact. But before we jump in, I want to tell you about Patreon. Patreon.com slash the Party Blarder. You can support me there. If you don't want to support me financially, you can join me on Discord, Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, Twitter, or just subscribe or leave a like or a comment. Any of those will do. But without further ado, let's jump into some horror games. All right, first we're going to be playing a game called Ron Ron. And from the screenshots, it looks like we're going to be in a wheelchair. That's going to be fun. Um, as you can see over here, the game is made in less than 24 hours. So it's going to be very short, as will all of the games in this video. So let's jump into Ron Ron and see what the game's about. And why it's Ron Ron and not Roll Roll if we're in a wheelchair. Yep, we're in a wheelchair. Okay. Shift run, not really. Wow. So just roll faster. Like, that's so rude. Just so, so rude. Can I not turn? Can I see this box? Nope, we're just going to go right right through the box. Look at that. Look at that. Lieutenant Dan, you ain't got no legs. All right, let's just go. So there's no S or A and D. Excuse me? I don't like that. No. See, this is even worse. Like, being chased is one thing. Like, I hate being chased. One, it's invisible. Two, I'm literally wheeling myself down this hallway. I can feel it getting closer. I can feel it breathing down my crack. Okay. I don't like that. Let's just keep going. Let's just go. Go up, 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 up. I'm glad this place is, you know, handicap accessible. Oh, gosh. Is that my shadow or is it, it that the thingy shadow? Oh no. I don't like it. Where do we need to go? Where do we need to go? Oh, we're trapped. Jeez, I'm peace. Okay, now instead of going up, let's just go straight. I just assumed with all the boxes there that we were supposed to go up the stairs or up the ramp, but I guess let's just keep going. Let's just keep going. Just go straight. I wish I had a brighter flashlight, you know. As in most horror games, I see I see light. I see daylight. Nope, can't go out there. Can't go up the ladder either, apparently. Oh, did it stop chasing me? Did it stop? Did it stop? Oh. Okay. Wait, that that's not a ladder. It's just uh just the texture on the corners of those. Can I leave? Hello? Hello? Can I leave? I want I want to get out of here, please. Please. Pretty please. I would I would like to get out. Ken has Ken has freedom. Okay. Can I go through these boxes? I can. <laughs> okay, so this is also a dead end, so maybe we need to go back the way we came. Even though there is clearly a way out back there where, you know, if I could stand, I could get through it. But, you know, since I'm I'm leg disabled. I'm disabled. Yeah, how are you disabled? Uh, leg disabled. I cannot. Oh, hi. Look at these dancing, dancing fellers. You screwed. Was that? You know, I appreciate games. I really like video games. That's why that's why I have a YouTube channel because I like playing all these games. But how are you going to have a disabled person that is just screwed? That's just rude. Let's get to the next video. Go away, GeForce experience. Nobody wants you here. The next game we're going to play is No Snake Hotel. It's another short horror game, and I assume that it's something about snakes in hotels, or maybe not snakes in hotels. So if it's no snakes in hotels, then I'm not allowed there. Just kidding. Welcome to the No Snake Hotel, the only hotel with a 99.99% no snake guarantee. Here at the No Snake Hotel, we pride ourselves in our incomprehensible lack of snakes. At other hotels, you run the constant risk of finding a snake in your bed sheets, a snake in your toilet, or 
even waking up to a snake sliding down your throat. It happens more than you'd think. Call the front desk for questions and enjoy your stay at the No Snake Hotel. A snake sliding down my throat? Awful. I like this. 99.99% guaranteed no snakes. No refund if a snake is seen. Alright. Well, this game looks really nice. That music's really loud. Just... Can you... Can you go away now, please? Okay, whatever. What are you? I just arrived at the hotel. Good golly, Bart, this place is immaculate. You know how much I hate snakes, so I went out of my way to stay at the No Snake Hotel. They've done... They've really done it, Bart. There are absolutely no snakes in this hotel. How do I... Or why do I feel like you are absolutely full of S-H-I-P ship? You're full of ships. Wait, what's it say? Step on it. All right. Find room 100. Gets 124. 123. 122. I don't like games that have this like weird bobbing effect like this. It's really just... Ugh. I'm living the dream. I didn't think it was possible, but I sure am happy it is. The No Snake Hoteller, Hoteller really lives up to its name. Ever since I was a little girl and I got abducted by an army of rabid snakes while on vacation, I haven't left my house. After 50 years in solitude, I finally have a safe place where I can vacation. Thanks, No Snake Hotel. Uh, you were abducted by an army of rabid snakes. Okay, we're not going to sprint yet because... I kind of making me sick here. Uh, what's that's not 100, is it? No. Everywhere except here. I feel safer than ever here. One time at some other hotel, I walked into my. Did I just hear a hissing behind me? Anyway, I walked into my room, and when I turned around to shut the door, there was a snake as long as my arm dangling from the coat hook. But here at the No Snake Hotel, I don't need to worry about that creepy Slytherin creatures might be standing behind me. Okay. How, why do I get the feeling that snakes wrote these? I know they don't have fingers or opposable thumbs. But, you know, I just have a feeling. Also, why are there doors barricaded and things? 105. 103. 100. Why is there blood on the floor? Excuse me. Ah, uh, I bet you it's a snake. Oh, you lied to me. I've been lied to. There was a snake the whole time. Oh gosh, no. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Scared the shit out of me. Uh, run, 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 run. Yeah, that's... Okay, well, it gave me the ending there, but yeah, there's no way to actually beat the game. You just die, regardless. Kind of like the last game. All right, let's go ahead and jump into the next one. All right, the next one we're jumping into is Note of the Day. I put up that warning for you guys there just in case because apparently this game has some flashing lights and things like that so let's jump into note of the day connecting to your world 5 4 2022 that's today uh-oh uh-oh does it know where i'm at do you know where i'm at oh it's all pixelated Oh, I can move. I am very, very slow. Holy crap. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Okay, well. I must be on some kind of uh, drug or something, man. Everything's super pixelated, super blurry, and I am slow. Press E to open door. Okay, well, apparently not. Nope, not to... Yeah, don't want to do that. That's just dumb. That's just dumb. Okay. There's something watching me. 
What am I supposed to do? Maybe I can open this door down here? Maybe, maybe, maybe. Oh, I can. All right. We close the door now? No. Even more cameras, there's something. It's a picture. Okay. What are you? Alrighty then. Can I can I read the note? I would I would very much like to read the note. It said no to the day. So I don't think there's a way to read that note, which is fine, I guess. But I would very much like to know where that buzzing is coming from. Hello, buzz, buzz, buzz. Buzz, 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 buzz. Can't open that one. Oh, I don't like this hallway. Not even a little bit. Is this a door? It looks kind of like... Wait, what? Nope. Can't open that one either. What is that down at the end? Is that a macro wave? A macro wave? No? Oh, it's a printer. It's just so pixelated. It's like I don't have my glasses on, but I do. I don't have blurry vision, I have pixelated vision. That's why I have to have glasses. You know, for the pixelations. Oh, why did you just open up randomly? Also, why did you just take me back to where I just was? Okay, can I go through this door now? No, okay. Okay, I guess not. Wow. It's rude. I don't like this. Okay, here's the light. I don't know if I want to turn around. Okay. All right. All right. Still can't go through there. I guess we're going to have to come back down here. It's going to take me 10 years to get there. Oh <laughs> my goodness. It's so slow. I really hope nothing chases me in this game because that would suck. Okay, so now there's two notes. Now there's two notes, but I cannot read them. Why can't I read these notes? Like, isn't isn't that the purpose of this game? Why would it be called Note of the Day if I can't read the notes? Well, maybe I need to switch these off. Maybe? No? Maybe not? Okay. Let's just, let's just turn the light back on. Okay, well, I can't. Oh, was I supposed to wait until all of the notes were laid? I don't know. Oh my goodness. How am I ever going to find my way out of here? There we go. What? Excuse me? Who are you? Sweet. Yeah, I've been trying, okay, Satan lady? been trying okay they're back on okay okay all right we're back oh great we're back in here again what's that why why is there crying please no no, 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 no. Me no lucky. Uh -uh. No. Oh, fantastic. Can I turn on the light now? There we go. Who's crying? The buzzing has turned into crying. Hello? Are you there? Oh, nope, the buzzing's still there. Jeez, I'm peas them. Okay. Well, I guess we're going to go back this way. Um. Uh. Can I turn you back on? Cool. That's really loud. It's like a water dripping, buzzing woman crying. All my favorite sounds, I guess. Okay, can I, I can't, I can't go, I can't, I can't, 
There's no crouch. Oh, there is crouch. Oh, I can I... Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, all I needed to do was crouch this whole time to read these letters. Okay, we're gonna read real quick. Having a job just feels useless. I come home, take a shower, eat dinner, and go back. There is no one waiting for me at home anymore. Will there even be someone left to read this letter? I feel like I'm just walking in circles. I keep hearing sounds that are not there. The silence is killing me. There's no way to communicate with anyone anymore. There are some dead bodies near my apartment, but it doesn't seem like anyone besides me has noticed. I don't know if someone is coming for them at any point, but if they do, I'll make them shoot me. Wow. I can't keep up with this bull S H I T any longer. There is no more food left. Plus I haven't gone to work for a month now. Useless. F the chair next to me, F the lamp, F everything. Why can't I just throw myself out the window? All around me are walls imploding or impeding me from doing anything at all. Okay, let's uh let's look at these notes with the lights off, because these I don't know if these things are, will put any glow in the dark stuff on them or not, but let's check it out. Okay, so none of these things have anything else on them that I can tell. If you look at them in the dark, um, I thought that maybe those those glow sticks might have put like a secret message on them, but apparently not. Okay. Well, now that we know how to crouch, let's just go ahead and continue on. Go under this bookshelf thing cabinet that has so graciously fallen in my way. Oh, oh boy. Oh, my shoulder. What is that? What are you? Why are you growing? Please don't turn off the light on me. Oh, there's doors on both sides. Dear Lord. Don't do it. Can I leave? Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Uh, let's try this door, maybe? I don't think I'm going to be able to. I can't. Things are growing on it. It got really loud. Holy crap, I got really loud. I'm zooming. We zooming. Oh gosh. Hello? Did I fall out of bed? Did I fall out of bed? Why am I so tall? There's a booby on my screen. Alright. Sounds like a noose and somebody crying. We should probably investigate it. Okay, can't go through that door. Or that door. Okay. Do we need to find like a key? What the, what the hell? Thank you guys so much for watching. I enjoy playing horror games. These were very short. Hopefully they were uh, they were good. I got scared, I think, in every single one of them. That's a first, actually, I think, for multiple videos in one. Before we go, let me tell you about patreon.com slash thepartyblarder. That's where you can support me monetarily, and I need to shout out a few people. Michael, Mega, Ryan Turner, Ryan Wilfong, Corey, and Roger. Thank you guys so much for your continued support. If you would like to support me, head on over there. There's three tiers, $1, $5, $10 that you can support me there. And don't forget to check out all of my links down below, and we will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.